What's up? It's Carrie. Welcome back. This, um, I'm going to do a really short sequence of just mindful movement. So this is not going to replace your workout by any means, but if you have started, like if your body has started to fuse to the couch and your eyes are square from Netflix marathons and you just need a little bit of movement, that's what we're going to do today. So I have, um, I have my mat, I have a strap. Um, if you don't have a strap at home, that's super fine. Just like a hand towel uh, should work just fine. Or if you've got an exercise band, any of that will work just fine. So we're just going to do a little bit of uh, movement and get that uh, blood circulating, okay? So go ahead and start on your back in kind of a constructive rest pose. So I'm going to be on my back, my feet are planted on the mat about hip distance apart, arms by my sides, palms facing the mat, so my palms are ground into the mat. And I'm just taking a couple of seconds here to connect to my breath. And then on the inhale, bring your right knee into your chest. Grab a hold of it, just grab the, um, the shin. Inhale and then exhale, pull in. Inhale to release. Exhale to pull in. Inhale to release. Exhale to pull in and this time go ahead and extend the left leg, flex the left foot. Just feel those legs working in opposition to one another. And inhale, exhale back to center. Go ahead and place both feet on the mat again. Nice bent knees, all the things. So from here, inhale and then exhale bring the left knee into the chest to grab around the shin or, or behind the thigh works too whatever inhale to release and exhale to pull it in inhale to release exhale to pull in inhale to release Exhale to pull in, extend the right leg, flex the right foot. Inhale and exhale. Good. Go ahead and place both feet on the mat again. Come back up to a seated position. And we're just going to do uh, a few kind of stretches. In, from an easy seat. So inhale, arms up. And exhale, right hand to left knee and twist. Inhale, come back to center. And exhale, switch sides and twist. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, switch. Inhale. Exhale, switch. Inhale. And one more time on either side. And exhale to switch. Great. Okay, go ahead and come to a tabletop position. So hands directly underneath your shoulders, knees directly underneath your hips. Inhale, drop your belly, open your chest, look up, tilt your pelvis up. And exhale, arch your back, really articulate your spine, tuck your pelvis in, gaze is toward your belly button. Inhale, belly back down, chest up. And exhale, back to that cat pose. Inhale to cow, exhale to cat, and then on the next inhale just return to a neutral spine. 
Good. So this time we're going to uh, thread the needle. So on the inhale, now keep the uh, weight evenly distributed between your two knees and inhale, sweep your right hand up and exhale, thread it through underneath your left arm. Inhale, sweep up. Exhale, thread it through. Inhale, sweep up. And exhale, thread it through. Come down onto your shoulder very carefully. Come down to the side of your head. Your left hand can stay where it is, just kind of pressing the mat away, or you can take it and place the back of your hand onto the sacrum, the flat part of the back, and breathe here. And inhale, press back up to that tabletop position, the neutral spine. Reestablish kind of that even weight on both sides and then inhale, sweep the left hand up, look up, and exhale, thread it through. Inhale to look up. Exhale, thread it through. Inhale, reach up, look up. Exhale, thread it through, come down onto your shoulder. And rest here. Place your right hand back down and press up to center, back to that tabletop position. Great. Okay, so inhale, send your right foot back and really flex your right foot. Now you're evenly distributed in weight, remember, so you're not cranking way over to one side. Just send your legs straight back and then exhale, bring your knee to your nose. Inhale, flex your foot like you're trying to stomp on the back wall. And exhale, bring your knee to your nose. Inhale, stomp back. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend your right leg back, and this time establishing your weight on both sides. If you're comfortable, bring your left arm up alongside your ear and breathe. Remember to flex your back foot. Nice strong back leg. And exhale back to center. Good, okay. We're gonna do the other side now because everything we do on one side, you know we gotta do on the other side. So from here, inhale and then exhale, bring the left foot back. Nice strong flex in the back foot. And exhale, knee to nose. Your knee is not actually touching your nose. I mean, yours might be, mine's not. And inhale, extend the leg. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend the leg. There's just no shame in that game, y'all. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, extend the leg. Extend the opposite arm, palm facing in. And breathe. And exhale, come on back to tabletop position. Good deal. Come on back to that easy seat. And bring the bottoms of your feet together. So you have Baddha Konasana legs, cobbler or butterfly legs. You're getting a little stretch in the inner thighs here. Inhale, reach up, interlace your fingers, and then press your palms toward the ceiling. Inhale to lengthen the spine and exhale to release. 
Good. Bring your hands behind your back. You can either interlace your palms or just grab opposite elbows. Inhale and then exhale, bow forward. Just bending in different ways can be very helpful. Inhale, go ahead and release your arms and just reach out in front of you. You can be here, you can be here, you can be wherever. As long as you're not super rounding in, try and keep your spine a little bit straight. And then when you've gone as far as you can go, then maybe you can round and relax into it. And just be in the shape. You don't need to make 100% effort here. Just hang out. And then inhale, come on back up. All right, extend both legs. So your sit bones are ground into the mat. Legs are extended, feet flexed. Inhale and then exhale, bend your, your right leg, <laughs> push your right leg on the floor. Inhale up and exhale to twist. You can take your elbow to your knee, kind of hook your elbow on your knee and then twist around. So you're using that elbow against the knee for a little bit of leverage. Inhale to lengthen the spine and exhale to twist. Looking over your right shoulder. Inhale, come back to center and switch. So the opposite leg goes over, inhale, and exhale, twisting around, hooking that elbow to the knee. Inhale to lengthen the spine and exhale to twist. Gazes over the back shoulder. And inhale back to center. Go ahead and take your legs out wide nice and wide on your mat, and then inhale to rise up, and exhale, just twist to the side. Maybe you're taking hold of your big toe. Inhale to open the chest, and exhale to come on down, getting a nice side body stretch through here. Flex your feet. And inhale back up to center, and switch. Inhale, open the chest and exhale to deepen. And come on back up. And down. And down. Go ahead and come to your belly. So just come around to the belly all the way down and just fall asleep. No, please don't do that. The um, tops of your feet are ground into the mat. And bring your hands out in front of your head. So maybe make 10 fingers with your hands. See, my hands aren't even too. So I'm making 10 fingers with my hands directly in front of my head. Now the movement here is coming from my chest and shoulders. So I'm not gonna crank my head and neck up. My head and neck are just along for the ride. So from here, inhale and bring the chest up. It's a slight back bend here. And exhale to release. Then maybe bring the hands in just a little bit more. So they're just a few inches in front of my head now. Inhale, chest comes up. And exhale. For a little bit more. Now my hands are directly underneath my shoulders and my elbows aren't glued into the side of my chest, but they're, you know, they're kind of hugging into the side of my body. Inhale, chest comes up. And I can stop here. Or if you want a little bit more, you can straighten your arms. Maybe your head comes back if it feels good. If not, a neutral neck is fine. Soften your belly. Shoulders back. 
and exhale, come on back down, good deal. All right, from here, go ahead and come back onto your back. And for this, you will want your, uh, your strap or your towel or whatever it is, but this is a super delicious leg stretch. So from here, go ahead and, and have your strap or your towel handy and extend your legs for just a second. And then inhale, bring your right foot in and place the strap or the towel around the ball of the right foot. So not the arch, don't do this number here, the ball of your foot, and then extend up, really extending through the heel. Inhale to extend and exhale to stretch. So using the strap to bring your foot towards you. The opposite leg is along the edge of the mat, foot flexed. Inhale to extend, exhale to deepen the stretch. And here again, you don't have to go to your edge. If you find your edge, maybe back off your edge a little bit. Maybe 70% effort here instead of 110. You know what I mean? We do enough of that. Inhale. And exhale, go ahead and take that leg out to the right using the strap. Inhale to lengthen, exhale to deepen the stretch. And inhale, come back to center. Go ahead and take the strap in the opposite hand. So bring your right hand down and let your left hand hold the strap. Inhale and then exhale, bring your right leg across the left side of your body. Your hip will pop up, but try and leave your shoulders down. Inhale to lengthen and exhale to pull the, pull the strap, pull the foot a little closer to you. And inhale back to center and switch legs. So go ahead and release the right leg and bring the left leg up, strap around the ball of the foot and stretch up. Inhale to lengthen the leg and exhale to bring that leg a little closer to you. Flexing the right foot, right leg extended along the mat. Inhale to lengthen. Exhale to stretch. Inhale and then exhale. Take your leg out to the left. Same thing, in inhaling to lengthen the leg and exhaling to pull the strap a little closer to you. And inhale, come on up. Take the strap into the right hand this time and bring the leg over to the right. Your hip will come up, but leave your shoulder down. Inhale to lengthen, exhale to stretch. Inhale, come on back up and lose the strap or the towel or the thing. Bring both your knees into your chest, wider than chest distance apart. Grab the outsides of your feet, which are equally wide apart, and just roll your back out and like a happy baby wallow, just wallow here. You can even play with like straightening legs. feels good. It's pretty delicious. And then release. Bring your legs down alongside the length of your mat. 
ankles to opposite corners of the mat. Arms out by your sides, palms flipped up. Shoulders underneath. Big inhale. And sigh it out. Big inhale. Feel free to stay in this resting position as long as you'd like. Otherwise, roll to one side. Gently press up to seated. And we'll seal our practice, hands to heart center. Thanks for practicing with me. See y'all later.